Okay, so here we have a simple LCD monitor. Uh, as you can see, it's a normal LCD monitor, real thin, a couple inches thick. And we're going to turn this into a multi-touch monitor. Uh, once again, this can be done with any size frame. This can be a, this is a 22 inch uh, monitor. It can be a 40 inch, a 50 inch, 60 inch, whatever size TV screen or LCD screen you have. It can be a projection image. There could be a projector underneath and we could be projecting and having an image created. And all you do to make it multi-touch is you take any of the frames and you simply put it on top. Uh, we're going to attach some of the double-sided sticky tape here to the frame and you know attach it so that when you touch down it doesn't slide around like you see here. Next we're going to install the software from PQ Labs. It comes on a CD. I have it here downloaded onto my computer. Driver software, just go ahead and install it. All right, once it installs, it says that it wants to run. Then you want to plug the USB cables in and the power cable. If you have a larger screen, the 24 inch, like I said before, only needs the USB power to make it run. Plug it on in. Here it's detecting the driver and installing. All right, you can see that as soon as it finished installing, the PQ Lab software automatically detected the serial number, the firmware, the hardware, what kind of screen it was. You can see it's exactly what it is. It's a G3 basic with six points and status says running okay and you can see that it's working. Now you can it's a little off and that's probably because it's not calibrated so we're gonna go into the calibration. Go into the calibration, simple white screen, all you gotta do is touch the point and let go as soon as it turns green. And you're done. Much better. So, fully supports Windows, fully supports Macintosh, uh, you can launch apps, since this is the six point multi-touch version, and it can do up to six points. One, two, three, four, four, five. I'm gonna clear that screen so you can see that better. Five and six. So if you try and do seven, you can see it's only doing one, two, three, four, five, six. So it'll do up to that amount. There's dual touch, there's 32 touch, and of course this is a six touch one that we're using now.